Welcome to Storex. In this video, we'll walk you through how to use N8N to automatically back up your Trello attachments and store them securely on Storex, your decentralized cloud storage solution. With just a few easy steps, you'll set up a workflow that fetches Trello card attachments, converts them into downloadable files, and uploads them directly to your Storex vault via S3 compatible integration. Let's dive in. Log into N8N and create the workflow and set the trigger we have used as schedule trigger. Search for the Trello using the open node panel and test your connection for the output. Since your connection is established properly and is working now, we can write a code to fetch only the attachment and use the HTTP request connection to convert the file into downloadable type and test the connection. Once the connection is established, now let's connect the StoreX to store the data and test the connections. To establish the connection between StoreX and N8N, you can refer to the document of our video. Introduction to N8N link is in the description. Congratulations! You have established the first backup of your Trello data to your StoreX account to investigate. Head to your StoreX account and search for the vault name Trello and view into it for more details. And that's it! You've successfully created an automated workflow that backs up attachments from Trello and stores them on StoreX. It's a seamless and secure way to ensure your important Trello data is safely preserved in a decentralized environment. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to check the documentation for the N8N integration in the description. Visit storex.io today to explore more, and don't forget to subscribe to Storex Network for the latest updates, features, and integration tutorials. See you in the next video.